song you're calling about, Jared? Don't Dream It's Over by Crowded House. Oh, OK, yeah. Where does that take you when you hear it, Jared? It just makes me think that the song comes on and nothing's impossible and just keep moving ahead. So it really inspires you? It does, mate. Yeah. Have you needed to rely on it many times in your life? Have you had, you know, like those dark moments that I suppose most of us have at times? Oh, we all get them, play the song, and it gives me a bit of a boost. <laughs> That's a cheap remedy. That's cool. Yeah. Yeah, awesome. And uh, I suppose you've you've loved the song since it first came out in the 80s, hey? I wasn't around the 80s. I'm only um, 17. Yeah, me fool, Jared. <laughs> well done. Okay, so it probably helped you through exams and stuff too. Yeah, all well, that kind of stuff. Yeah. The apprenticeship and all that. Oh, okay, you're still in your apprenticeship? You would be. I am. I am, yes. See, if you, if you hadn't have told me that, I would have thought, oh, no, you, that's well behind you. You're well qualified now. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah. Oh, metal fabricator. Uh -huh. Oh, well, good luck. Have you got long to go? No, I've got another two years left. Oh, well, you'll breeze through as long as you keep listening to your song. That's right. Yeah, good on you. Thanks, Jarrett, for letting us know the story behind Don't Dream It's Over from Crowded House. No worries, mate. Thank you. Here it is on WSFM.